All right, so this is how I make the shrimp tacos. So I use some cumin, some black pepper, garlic, um, some sazon. This is about a pound of shrimp. And I use smaller size shrimp because I don't want the bigger shrimp falling all out of the, the um, tortilla. I got this. Um, you can get this out of the produce section. I just like this because it's easy. Um, and some olive oil. And I have some onion and some fresh garlic here. So what I do is I just take a little bit of olive oil. A little bit of olive oil, mix it around, and make sure the shrimp are shelled and deveined. Okay. All right. So we're gonna just season liberally. A little bit of salt. onion and the fresh garlic. I'm gonna also add some cilantro, but I'm gonna add that in a minute. So now you can let this marinate for a couple of hours and then I'll be there. Alright, so you're gonna take a pan, add just a little bit of olive oil, I'm going to take your marinated shrimp, And you're gonna cook just until it's done. And then you're gonna add in either your favorite pico or you can make your own pico. You're just gonna add a little bit. I make my own. I will leave uh, the video to where I make my pico in the description box. There we go. And you're just gonna let that cook. And then I'm gonna add just a tablespoon of ketchup. That's it. I know it sounds weird, but it works. Do not overcook your shrimp, okay? And I'll be back. Okay, so now to heat my tortillas, what I do is I take a, you can use either a cast iron, nonstick, whatever you want to use. I'm just using my uh, paella pan. I heat it and I add just a little bit of oil in there with the paper towel just to coat it. And then I add my tortillas. 
And you're just going to heat them through for like 30 seconds on each side. And you need a spatula. And then you're going to wrap them in paper towel or a um, cloth napkin or something. As you can see, it's starting to heat. You see it start bubbling up. And you're just going to wrap them in paper towel or cloth, like I said, until you get as many heated as you need. Okay. <clears throat> so I just showed you how to do the corn tortillas. I did the flour tortillas the exact same way. Just heat them like 30 seconds on each side and wrap them in paper towel or a cloth. It's up to you. All right. So now we're going to assemble the... Tacos. I also made some beef tacos. Um, I didn't record that, just, but I will next time. So I'm gonna take two corn tortillas. Okay. Put them in there like that. You're going to do either some shredded cabbage or some shredded lettuce. And a little bit of the cotija cheese or whatever kind of cheese you want. You can use shredded cheese, whatever. It don't even matter. And then some of your pico or salsa. Whatever you want to do, child. So then I'm going to take Y'all can say why are you even showing us that if you didn't cook do the record the video? Well, I don't know. And then now you can add sour cream or you can use the crema. Nobody eats this but me, the crema. So yeah, these are for them. So that is it. I'll be back once. I'm gonna let you get a final look. I'll be right back. All right, so. Here they are, the final tacos, the final setup. Um, you can top it with whatever kind of cheese or whatever you want. Um, like I said, you can use shredded cabbage or shredded lettuce. I let, I'm using lettuce because my kids are weird sometimes. So, so I have to, you know, hurt nobody. I just use lettuce. But that is it, y'all. Thank y'all so much for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.